Hello everyone, Newborn Investor here and welcome to another video. Today we are gonna review my trading performance for the month of May. For those who are new to my channel, I'm a Newborn Investor and I opened a Roth account in February 2020 which I've been using to trade since. We will start with the trades for the month of May in TraderView and then we will get into my brokerage account to verify the trades. The whole purpose of me doing this review is to hold myself accountable for my trades and to set a realistic expectation on what you can achieve through trading. I'm a swing trader and I journal my trades in TraderView when I close the trades so that the profits are lost from the trades reflects in the closing month rather than the month in which I open my trade. So without further ado, let's look into my trades for the month of May. As you could see, I have a 100% win rate so far, which means all the trades that I took so far in May were profitable. For May, I took 7 trades and my highest winner was $310 on IRM. Good for me as I did not have any losing trades that month. My smallest winner was $30 on RTX. It was a scratch trade as I was in just 8 shares. My average winner was $121 and with the small share size that I trade, I think my gains are decent enough. Obviously, there are traders out there who make the same amount in minutes and I hope to be one such trader in the future. As of now, my goal is to spin off $1,000 a month from trading, which hopefully I will get to. Alright, so now to verify my claims, let me head to my brokerage account and show you my trades from my trading account. Filtering for the month of May. As you could see, the trades for the month reflect what I just showed in TraderView. And also since I trade using Fidelity, I pay $0 in commission. So what you're seeing is my net profit. In total, for the month of May, I made $848 in net profits. Alright, that's it from me for this video. So if you're enjoying my content, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Until we see next time, thanks for watching. Bye.